Hello, I'm Olivia Britton. And I'm Elena Gingrich. Welcome back to Channel 21 News. We come to you with a lot of breaking stories, so let's get started. Let's move into our first story, global warming and how it's affecting Michigan. As everyone knows, Michigan is known for our crazy weather. Elena, I'm so sorry to cut you off. I'm getting word that there's a breaking story. We have to send it over to our reporter on the scene. But what about my stuff? I, this is way more Take urgent. it away, Ava. Hey guys, I have come to you with a dangerous epidemic, non-point source pollution. I went over to our friends at Wemiac and we discussed what exactly was going on. Hi, my name's Hannah Maiko. I work for the West Michigan Environmental Action Council. Non-point source pollution is present in the environment everywhere, but we don't know exactly where it comes from. We can make assumptions about where it might come from, but it can come from a bunch of different places. So it could come from farms, it could come from residential areas, it could come from pollutants that end up on our road. Hello, I'm Autumn Elkins, and we are going to be taking a look at the weather forecast for this upcoming week. As you can see here, we have very harsh rain coming our way, which plays a very bad role when it comes to non-point source pollution. Welcome back to Channel 21 News. I'm Annabelle Mashili here with the traffic on our own I-91 highway. If you take a look here, you'll see that there's a lot of cars, which makes a lot of more oil spilling onto the grasses on the side of the highway. The new oil is spread into rivers from rain. Cars are a harmful addition to non-point source pollution. Viewers at home may be wondering how you can prevent non-point source pollution. The answer's simple. You can use less fertilizer and reduce the amount of oil you use in your car, like taking the bus or carpooling with a friend. That's so cool. You can also dispose of pet waste properly and household chemicals. If you do all of this, you'll be saving the environment. Thanks for watching Channel 21. For more information, go to groundswell.org.